So there's a part to your spider that has been asked about a lot online. Now I've noticed that there's not a whole lot of answers or discussion about it. And even in your manual, it's just mentioned in five places, but it's not really in detail of what it is or how to change it or what it's used for. So a lot of people don't even know what it is and it is important to your spider. So why haven't even mentioned it yet? Well, I'm gonna cover this little secret for you in this video and hope you enjoy. So what is the item that's not talked about much? Well, it's behind this cover here on the engine. Yeah, that's right. It's even hidden by a cover. Now I'll be doing two videos. The first one, which is this one, will be talking about what it is and go into detail of what it is. And the second video will be covering how to replace, repair, and then the torque settings and things that you need to do to replace and change this item. Now what is this little secret that we're talking about finally? Well, it is the HCM oil filter and it is behind this little cover here on the right hand side of your bike or the throttle side if you want a specific position. Now your engine oil is shared with your gearbox, your clutch, your transmission and hydraulic control module, HCM. The HCM oil filter is a suction type filter and it is most commonly referred to as your HCM transmission filter or transmission oil filter. Now, if many of you follow me, you know that I do like to take everything apart. I like to show you in detail and I'm actually the one doing it. But in this video and the next video as well, I won't actually be taking everything apart because if you follow me again, I've recently had a major repair done to the motorcycle and it does involve the HCM filter. Now it wasn't the cause of it, but they do replace it. So I'm not going to change it or basically do anything for a while until I'm ensured that this vehicle is basically in tip top shape and it is driving a lot better. So thank you guys for the support and everything like that as well. But in the second video, I'll go into as much detail as I can and also break everything down using schematics and pictures to show you and give you detail of how to replace, change it and the torque settings and what the settings are for it. In your owner's manual, there's only five places where the HCM oil filter is mentioned page 114, page 116, page 119, and it's mentioned in two places on page 169. So one of the main questions I see is, when do I need to change it? Well, here's what can -Am says. In your owner's manual, it says you should change it every 45,000 kilometers or 28,000 miles. In the manual, you'll also notice that it takes 4.9 liters or 5.2 quarts when changing it. That is all that it references in your owner's manual. In the service or repair manuals, it says you should replace it when you have a slipping clutch, as it could be a sign that it is clogged. If your vehicle is not prepared properly after being stored, and this is important in the winter, and this is a good idea to change it after you store it for the winter time. At the 45,000 kilometers or 28,000 mile intervals, and after any repair or damage to the transmission clutch engine, as there is contaminants that may be in the filter. Now, when I'm looking online in a lot of the chat rooms, they mention that you should replace it every time you change your oil. And now, I am sure that this would not hurt at all, and I've also heard some mechanics say that it should be changed after every oil change as well. So, that is a good point and a good time to change it as well, because that is a filter, and having your oil changed and clean is the best way to keep your engine running.